I realize it's drastic, but I've given it a lot of thought. I don't want to go somewhere. I don't want to leave you. I know. But hopefully it won't be for too long. How do you know? I mean, it could take weeks before you find whoever's behind this big drug ring. Darling, the fact is you're not safe here anymore. Those people have targeted you, and we can't assume they're going to let go until they know you're out of the picture. They could very well come back and try again. I can't let it happen. We could put a guard at the house. You know, something to follow me back and forth to work. Is that what you want? Be deja vu of what it was like after the rape? No. I don't want that, but you can't expect me to leave without saying the to my family and my... I think your family will understand. I think they'll be ecstatic to know that you're safe. And frankly, I think the children will be safer too with you gone. Plus, if we turn the house into a fortress again, it's just not good for them. They should be able to go outside and play without having to check with an armed guard every single time they want to take a step. I realize it's awful, but I really don't see that we have another choice. So you got to put me into a body bag or what? Yes. And we're going to take you in an ambulance and get you to the airport and put you on a plane. Everybody's going to think you're still in this room in a coma. And then once you're safely in the air, the news will hit the media that you have regained consciousness and are expected to be able to identify your attacker. Hoping the attacker will come here to the hospital. Exactly. And once he does, we should be able to nail him. Once we have him, he should lead us to the others. And hopefully once every last rancid one of them is in the bag... You'll be able to come home. I'm sorry. I really wish there was some other way. We're ready. I got the guardian right outside. Okay. Just a minute. You, you want me to go down like this? Sweetie. <sighs> There'll be suitcases on the plane. I put a change of clothes in the van. I hired a private nurse. She'll help you dress. I'm sorry. I have no choice, baby. You know I love you. You know I love you. More than anything, I love you, baby. 